Today we will use broomstick stitch design to, to make a scarf. Um, for this we will need um, a ball of white yarn and you can see it's super bulky yarn. Um, you will also need a ball of pink yarn or any other two colors that you can um, think of or you can do it solid one color. You will also need number 9 hook, um, US number 9, 9 millimeters, or N, and you will need um, a needle uh, for that that is 50 millimeters in diameter, or you can use anything you have in the house. Um, I will use um, part of my vacuum cleaner uh, which is in uh, one diameter and you can see it's big and uh, um, long enough to hold uh, the scarf. Uh, you can also use, if you are using super bulky yarn, you can also use um, the um, part of your uh, bounty um, towel or you can um, use any anything that you have in the house um, that is even diameter and long enough. So um, let's um, start. Okay, let's start our scarf and we will start with white yarn. We will make a knot. We will make a knot. Um, and we will chain 16, chain it loose. Um, you don't want You don't want to have um, a tight line in, in the middle of the scarf. Six. Let me. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Sixteen stitch. Pull through and put it on a um, broomstick. Now, make a stitch from each, make a stitch from each stitch of the row before, pull it through, put it on a um, needle. You will have 16 stitches when you are finished. Okay, now we have all 16, the white stripe is ready, we will take it off, this is what we, we have, okay, now we will start um, the pink stripe, same thing, make a knot, chain 16 loose, and then 3, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Pull it through. Put it on the stick. And now do every single stitch on a chain and put it on a um, broomstick. Come on. Okay, let me finish all of them. Um, and I'll show you. Okay, now we have 15 pink ones. Let's take it off. Here we have 15. Okay, okay, now you have um, one thing that um, you created with um, white yarn, your stitches on white yarn, and another one that you created in the pink yarn. You will put them next to each other and you will need to connect them. 
and for this you will use um, for this you will use uh, a hairpin um, technique to connect to um, pieces of hairpin. Uh, we will braid them. I'll show you how to braid them. This can be done using a hook or um, it can be done without the hook. You just pull um, a part of pink yarn through the um, part of pink stitch through the white stitch and then you uh, pull next white stitch through this pink stitch um, and then you pull next pink stitch through your white stitch and you continue like this you continue like this until you uh, meet end of the row be very careful not to miss any uh, stitches in in any row okay let me um, complete this and I'll show you um, how it will look like okay so you are braiding them um, right now it doesn't look very pretty let me finish and I'll show you what we will do okay now you uh, braided everything and what you will need is to um, pull pull them like this So the braids tighten and you can see the um, you can see the picture hold on a second okay so you pull them through everything is neat um, you have the last stitch you're gonna pull the yarn through it so you don't lose it and we will uh, finish it later okay so uh, you have a yarn here um, so now let's let's continue we will make another pink on this side and another white on this side and then um, we will start all over again and connect them so let me show you how to uh, continue okay so we will take our piece that we have um, we will put a stitch through and put it on the broomstick so you can see we have our already connected piece and uh, we will use it right so next stitch put it on the broomstick next stitch put it on the broomstick and we will do like this until we finish and we will have all 16 stitches again every single stitch let me finish and I'll show you okay so now we have all 15 stitches um, on a broomstick we will take them off like this so we have another piece of our um, scarf done okay now we um, we turn it <coughs> another side we still have white and we will start with white um, we will make second part of white yarn uh, of white Pull it through, put it on a stitch, or on a broomstick, another, do the second one, pull it through, put it on the needle, pull it through, put it on the needle, four, let me finish and I'll show you okay okay so you see 
um, everything is done on the white side, finished, we will take it off. So um, now we will have same thing on the white side. Now we will make another piece like that and we will join it. We will make another piece um, that look exactly like that and, and we will join it with the, from this side and we will be, make another piece and we will join it from this side. So let me uh, make it and I'll show you. As you can see, we prepared uh, five pieces of um, of the scarf and we will con combine them together now. Uh, same, we will use the same exact uh, technique. We will braid, um, use the braiding to combine the pieces. Okay, um, you have a piece um, and what we want to do now is to finish, uh, to m make the edging. Um, to the end of the scarf. So we're gonna braid it also. We're gonna braid it as we braid it um, As we connected this but the easy way is to braid so so What you will do is um, You will take the last stitch you have and pull the previous one into this and then the previous one into the next one next one into this and this like this and we will do it till the end of the row you see what we will have is nicely nice finishing nice edging to the end of the scarf and the last one okay so you can see that right now this side has all the stitches from all the connections that we have currently and and um, we will put the yarn through it so we can lately close it properly so this is what we have this is the scarf this is the scarf um, this is the edge from one side with braiding and this is the edge from another side was braiding um, all the stitches that we got um, I pulled through the yarn from um, from each side and I just tied the knot on each side and same um, same here you see you see the stitch and I pulled the yarn through and I tie the knot. Um, and um, now what you can do is you can put the simple stitch, use the simple stitch um, to go around the edge on each side um, to finish up. So this is what I'm doing right now. Um, and this will be the scarf. So it's very easy to make, very um, um, it's gonna take you a couple of hours to do that. So enjoy it.